Hello, and welcome to this MXCT 300 project presentation. This is Team Uranus by Luke Kindelin and Abigail Morris. This project has two parts, a short-range behavior and a waypoint behavior. For the short-range behavior, Team Uranus was the lead robot with an orange pylon hat. Another partner team's robot needed to follow Team Uranus's robot that was being manually driven. This part was very simple for Team Uranus, so this presentation will be over the second part. The waypoint behavior required the robot to guide itself to a GPS latitude and longitude that was inputted by the user. It also needed to scan for any obstacles and to maneuver around them. After avoiding these obstacles, the robot then needed to recalculate its course and adjust its bearings. The mission strategy was to use a laptop with LabVIEW code. This code would be calculating the course of the robot would take and monitoring for any obstacles and driving the motors based on the decisions being made. For the waypoint behavior, we first need to calculate the distance between the robot's current position and its desired position. Doing this, we used a reference point to minimize the errors in the calculations. Using this information and the data from the gyroscope, we calculated the heading towards the target. Using the heading towards the target, we then needed to make decisions based on what the motor should do. The robot would use the target heading and the current heading to turn until they are both the same. The robot would then drive in a straight line until it was within 5 meters of the desired target. While the robot is driving towards the desired target, it is also looking out for obstacles. With a sonic sensor pointed towards the ground, it is looking for a change in the distance to know when there is an obstacle in its way. When there is an obstacle detected in the path, the robot will run a through a scenario. It will turn right, go straight for a set time, turn left, and go straight for a set time again to get around the obstacle. After, the ro after, after this, the robot will recalculate its heading and continue on a new path. Now we play a video to demonstrate the obstacle avoidance. Team Uranus was able to go to a GPS distance location within 5 meters. It was also able to avoid obstacles and it could be manually driven. Open issues would be the lighting that impacted the short range behavior and the GPS module was not very reliable because it would stop working suddenly with no external change. This has been the MXCT 300 project presentation by Team Uranus. Thank you.